I keep my sister's decapitated head in my closet. This one comes at us from that really short chick. And before I start this review, I just have a question. Has anyone here ever heard of the movie Basket Case? Well, this story is kind of similar to that movie. It's about a guy named Mike whose sister is killed in a horrendous accident when they were just kids. One where her head is completely knocked off. Well, our main character starts seeing her severed head in a box, even though no one else can see it for some reason. The rest of the story, like I said, plays out a little bit like the movie Basket Case, only instead of tracking down all these doctors and killing them, the sister's head sits in a box and tells our main character, Mike, to grab her victims to eat. This creepypasta is incredibly disturbing <laughs> and just really gruesome in a lot of ways. I think if you like those kind of stories, you'll really enjoy this one. And to be fair, this actually wasn't that bad of a story. Um, it's not one of my favorites, but it's definitely got an element of gore and psychological horror to it, which I really like. Um, and again, it's very disturbing and is very gutsy to say the least. The way that this little girl dies is really, really disturbing. And I honestly would say just for that purpose alone, definitely give this one a listen. It's, uh, it's very shock horror-like, but it's well-written, it's well-paced, has some dark comedy elements to it, and all in all, I think it's worth your time. Check it out.